And here in the nation, South Korea's southwestern city of Gwangju has raised its social distancing level a notch after a bout of new COVID-19 inspections. For the first time since the outbreak began, the city on Wednesday reported new daily cases in the double digits. Our Lee sin explains. Quarantine measures are in full swing at a welfare center for the elderly, operated by a religious group in the southwestern city of Gwangju. This is because a woman in her 50s, who is a caregiver, was confirmed to have COVID-19. Additional infections began popping up at the facility, with several more confirmed at the church the caregiver attended last weekend. However, it's not yet known how the initial patient caught the virus. As the number of so-called blind spot infections continues to increase, the city's social distancing level was raised on Wednesday to level two. If this persists, we are worried that this will cause serious damage to the safety of our community. Level two social distancing means indoor gatherings of 50 or more people are now banned, as well as 100 or more for outdoor events. Public facilities are closed for the next two weeks, while collective restrictions on high-risk facilities have been imposed. Sporting events will continue without fans, while quarantine measures will be strengthened where people in the city tend to gather most. South Korea continues to see COVID-19 cases scattered across different parts of the country, including in Nonsan, a city in Chungcheongbuk-do province. The city reported its seventh infection on Wednesday, raising concerns that the recent spike in cases in Daejeon is spreading to nearby areas. As the country continues to try and contain the virus, city officials hope the tougher social distancing measures can stop the spread in its tracks. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.